Archbishop David Oyedepo. This, this, this appeal is to you. I am on my knees, on my knees begging. Instead of the 100,000 capacity, another 100,000 capacity church, please set up 100,000 employment value for Nigerians or Nigerian youths. Honestly, we have heard the word. We, the youths, we have heard the word. As a matter of fact, the prosperity that we have heard from you can last us another 100,000 years. Both the ones you have recorded. We, I beg you in the name of Almighty God that you serve, instead of the 100,000 capacity church, give us a 100,000 capacity industry that will employ people and they earn on a monthly basis. You have a school, not as if you don't have several means of earning livelihoods. Not as if honestly people are not employed under you working in your ministry. But everybody is not in, uh, are, not, are not supposed to always, we might not all work in the vineyard of God. Some persons are engineers, some persons are surveyors, some persons are lawyers, some persons are several things out there on the road. Some people, persons are doctors. Your school even produces a lot of persons. Now, the amount of people your school produces, have, have you been able to employ all of them? Building capacity just that every day, every Sunday morning, on regular basis, people come to donate. This is not the time for this. Nigeria needs more, other, better values than church. The Europeans that brought church will don't have all these capacities, but we heard the gospel in, the, in Africa. I beg you in the name of God, Papa. In the name of God who made heaven and earth. I beg you, my name is Chidiwaya. I am begging you. Please, please, in the name of God. Instead of 100,000 capacity church, instead of, of even another school, yes, we need schools and all that. First of all, try to make your school cheaper for us. Create employment for, for, for youths, not 100,000 capacity church. Don't take offense. I am not trying to join issues with you or start. I can't fight. I don't have the power. But I'm telling you the truth that every Nigerian youth, all of us roaming the streets, all the people who, who organize answers, this will be their wish. This will be the wish of every man out there who protested against the bad government, who protested against police brutality. Or oh, this will be the wish of all of us. And we are telling you the truth. And I'm telling you today that we prefer you create more room for employment of Nigerian youths, more room for employment of Nigerians than building 100,000 capacity church. That money you're going to dump there will help nobody. It, what it, it, are you are trying to just build an edifice or get, it, have, get involved in the, whatever is it Guinness Book of Record or what? But please, this is what will create value. It is not the time for the word now. It's the time for application of the word. Apply that word and let it become life in some of us who are your followers, who attend your churches. Please, sir, don't take offense in what I've said. I've told you my mind and that is the truth. Every Nigerian will love what I just said because we need... People like you who have made money from us. You have gotten all the tithes and the offering. So you can let invest it so that we can also have from you and pay back to you directly or indirectly. I beg you in the name of God. Thank you, sir, and God bless you.